The bottom right icon is your attributes table. When that is selected, it will bring up a table of all of the points. By default, it only shows you the points that are within the current map extent. So if I zoom in a bit, you can see there are only two points on the map right now, and you can there are only two records in the table. To turn that off, though, is that second option here where it says uh, filter by map extent. We'll click that to turn it off. It's on by default, but turn it off whenever you need. And this will give you all of the points that are on the HFC waiting list, regardless of whether or not they're in the map. Uh, something else I want to show you is if we come over to this options, we can set a filter, uh, add an expression. Let's say we only want to see the points that ha are scheduled to be installed on May 4th. So we'll come over here and select scheduled install date uh, is on and we'll select May 4th and we'll say okay. And our table will filter down also the map will filter down. So we can see the four points that are scheduled for install May 4th. Another thing you can do here under the options menu is export selection to CSV. This would uh, give you a CSV file which you could open in Excel and print and provide that list to your team going out and doing the install that day. So they would have a nice quick reference to all the addresses that they were going to. I'm going to cancel that though. Uh, additionally, you can, can double click on one of these rows and let's see if it works on an iPad. Oh, there it goes. Uh, double click it and say zoom to and it will actually zoom you to that particular address on the map. Uh, that might be a little bit more helpful when you have a, a large list when there's only four on the table at the moment. It's not quite as impressive, but still pretty cool. Okay, let's clear selection. There we go. And to, to hide the attributes table again, just click on the attributes table icon at the bottom right there. And that will eliminate the, the attributes icon. You can see that the the map is still filtered. Uh, so be careful of that. Uh, to if, you, if that happens to you, to remove the filter, open the attributes, I, the attributes table back up uh, by clicking on the attributes icon. And then back under options in the filter, come in and click the X next to the filter to clear it. Say okay. That will clear the filter. You can then close the attributes table and see that all of your points are there. So don't freak out if suddenly points are missing. You probably just have a filter set on the attributes table.